Whether it's swiping a key card, punching in a code, to sleeping in your dorm, or is it opening up a car door, turning on your keys, and driving to school? Rhode Island College has two types of students. These types of students are the commuters and residents. Hello everybody, I'm Isaac Bean. Today we're going to be discussing the differences between the commuters and residents and how often they actually see each other. Let's interview some commuter students and see how often they interact with residents. I probably never interact with residential students because I just hang out with everyone who I have classes with and we're all commuters. Um, I think it's because there's no clubs or anything that I personally do where I would interact. Like I know people in fraternities and sororities and they interact with residents, but not me. Now let's ask a resident the same question and see if he interacts more with commuters or residents. More often with commuters. Yeah. Why do you think that is? Um, this is a affordable school. Um, you know, it's pretty close to Providence. It's, it's very nice facilities for the price. I could definitely see a lot of people wanting to commute here to save money. If you head over to the internet and look up Rick's commuter percentage and hit search, it gives a very high number of 85%, according to Rick's website. With such a high percentage of commuter students, it explains why both residents and commuters feel like they interact more with commuters than residents. Residential students don't enter other people's dorms. They stay in their own dorm. Nor do commuters ever go in dorms unless they have friends that are residents, which is rarely ever. After the research, the interviews, I have concluded that commuter students and residents are more similar than they are different. Although one goes to school in a car, the other one sleeps at school, they're still very similar. They both get the same education, they both only interact with commuters, and they don't interact with residents. So after all this information, commuters and residents can be together because they're practically the same. This is Isaac Bean reporting to you live from Rick News.